after about 15 years, I'm back in Vienna. Um, I heard people say it's just a big city in Solis, but we'll see how true that is. Giant pigeons have taken over the city of Vienna. A pay telephone. I remember these. This is pretty cool. This is St. Stephen's Cathedral. They have a huge organ. Another large church. The best sculptures are on the side of buildings. Yes, the ducks followed me here. That is a really well designed theater. This definitely feels Romanesque. Okay, let's try a celebrated coffee shop here in Vienna. A taste of Gothenburg in Vienna. Cappuccino. I found the amusement park. This is what the Austrians call ein Riesenrad. This could be a little bit dizzying. We got ourselves a haunted house here. Oh, how sweet. This is a museum quarter on a Sunday morning. And it is dead. Inside one of the museums, they have this tribute to video game systems of the past. I used to have this Pac-Man game when I was little. Do we all remember these different game cartridges? Here they even have the portable Turbo Express or PC Engine Express. They even have the Neo Geo Pocket, my favorite. That's Maria Teresa. It looks like they're starting to set up the Christmas market in front of City Hall. Yeah, this message is from my friend Elon. Elon, I like your store here in Vienna, but your store in Gothenburg is much nicer. Apparently, these angels are good at killing serpents. Gutenberg, one of the most important people ever. That's a really nice tapestry. This monument is in remembrance of the Jews killed during the Nazi period. It looks like people have placed stones on top of it. Now that's impressive. It's a Vienna manhole cover. This is a musty attraction here in Vienna, Hundertwasser House. Very artistic. There's a lot of different types of windows. And a lovely fountain. I know where the staircase is. Behind me is Belvedere Palace. It looks pretty cool. This guy is a really shiny shield. Hang in there, buddy. 